And Kunal Chaudhry does it. And Crystal Wong will be in the women's singles final, taking out top seed Jachi Zen. Oh my god, he almost took out Larry He Kessler. did, he did. <laughs> oh, what a quality deep push by Han Shao to join the final four. Hazinski with the serve match point. And Hazinski takes the tie, takes the match. Seymour is just on his feet back there. We will have a new men's singles champion, champion here in Las Vegas, Sean. Mark what a match. Look at the smile on his face. Game seven, here we go. I want to make some noise right now, Sean, but I'm going to be in everybody's ear if I do. This is as good as it gets in table tennis, people. Here we go. Game number seven, Patrick Sharp, Jojo. This is the stuff you dream of when you're a kid, right? Game seven, national championship, finals. So calm, so cool. With Beautiful. The control, yeah, controlled nice opening. Nothing rushed, nothing forced. Canal playing a very, very mature match this match. Always choosing the right shot. Returns an edge ball, comes back. That guy played, Canal played that point like he is a 30 year old veteran out there as a professional Butler, player. Butler had an edge of his racket, edge of the back table. Canal able to return it. No one giving an inch in this that final That was, you're game. right, Sean, the double edge. Went off the top of Jimmy's racket and the edge of the table. the early three point and we're going straight three. through Sean there's nowhere to go no timeouts you got to get back up to the table and keep going extremely impressed right now with Kanal Chaudhry and his being able to hold his nerves and perform and an edge, edge on his side of the table so Chaudhry with a very strong start at up 4-0 in game seven Butler just trying to get on the board right now. Very strong serve. It's that same serve he was indecisive with in the last game. like Crystal Wong's backhand over the table. Yep. Just Butler didn't have the footwork and to get out there. And this kid really has some sweet hands, Sean. If I'm Chaudhry right now, I definitely start serving much more long, longer serves. Just I keep, I can, challenge. I keep that underspin to Jimmy's forehand. That serve. Ooh, that was top spin though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was top spin. He needs to go with the under. Jimmy, Jimmy keeps <laughs> moving over there. Jimmy he can't, can't flip that ball. Jimmy it's can create some insane angles with his backhand on the forehand side. You gotta give him the underspin. Here it comes. That's the underspin. Yep. And there's Butler 
getting his loop going. Just seems back and forth, both players, whoever's making that first loop, is having difficulty continuing it. And when Jimmy got that net ball there in the middle of that rally court, forcing Canal into a little bit of a scramble mode. It's almost like Canal's always expecting a potential net ball because he's so soft with his yeah. hands. Now it's Coach Lee who wishes he had a timeout. <laughs> In first four or five points. If Jimmy's Jimmy. able to tie this up at five, that'll be a little bit of a... Huge advantage, Jimmy, if he ties it up at five. Emotional victory to bring himself back into this game. play by Butler not rushing any of those shots forcing a forehand in there yeah if if, if I'm Canal there and if I'm going to just sit there and spin soft right now I step back up to the table and play a soft block and then step back and go back, go back it would have forced Butler just to throw up a soft fishing return yeah. and he could have turned on because that ball this is just soft spinning kind of going on really consistent and steady but if, so, if either one of them would have been played a soft one Butler with a toe-to-toe -to -toe battle. Canal was looking to turn at about three different points during that point. And he's got to be able to think of something else, right? And the other thing he has to do is what he did to get that 5-0 lead. Get the ball out to the Jimmy forehand. He should take the backhand. Instead of going to Jimmy's backhand after one or two, changing direction and going down the line. What a battle here. Butler with another combination heavy push and then the inside out backhand block with side spin. If you're going to loop that ball, you've got to loop it down the line. There's not enough angle to get around the outside of the ball. Jimmy taking the last six points in a row. was one deep push. If that didn't touch the white line, it was a millimeter in front of it. Just completely jammed Canal. Unable to get the ball up and over the net. Reach for that ball. Saw a ball that he liked. Went for just a tad too much. Lifted it out. And two critical, two critical serves for Chaudhry. Again, that side spin backhand block. Jimmy telling himself just to calm down. You see after the heavy push, the upspin, and then the backhand around the outside of the ball. And Chaudhry's missing it off the side of the table. That where the spin's going, he's not even making an adjustment for the side spin. Yeah, I think they kind of got him in the middle there. Yeah! Now Butler with four match points. Now calming himself down after again holding the table so well, forcing the forehand in. It's just reminding himself to calm it down. I've never seen Jimmy in the last two years of his comeback get so energized after a point, but this is the national championships he's going for. 
trying to add a fourth crown. And that ball goes wide. That would have been a way to finish it though, right, Sean, with the classic Jimmy Butler backhand? Yeah. I really think Jimmy would be well served to try to get his forehand in and then follow with the backhand versus just getting into the exchanges. And this match is far from over. Chaudhry with the serve. Well, it can't be that much far. That can't be that far, Sean. <laughs> We're, we don't have any games left. Just see Chaudhry making quality forehand loops. These aren't loops just to hope to put the ball on the table. He's driving through the ball. He's got the serve. Let's see if Butler's able. Might be a hell of a time to serve long. I don't think we're gonna see it though. And Butler's done it. Butler has won the 2014 National Singles Championship. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Kunal and your national champion, Jimmy Butler! What a comeback. Not only in the seventh, but from injuries, making the world team. And now, a big hug from Coach Victor Sabone and a bigger hug from Brother Scott, the butler has done it again. And there's Father Dick Butler, recent Hall of Fame inductee, couldn't be more proud. Here we see the final point once again. Great serve and Butler just can't believe himself. What a conclusion to a great competition here in Las Vegas. Hugs around the court for Jimmy Ladies Butler. Please welcome Judy Forfrost. As we and send Judy it Warfrost, down. President of Paddle Palace to present the runner-up award for the Men's Open at the 2014 USA TT National Championship to Kunal Chaudhry.